Uh, right, this is um, my uh, evaluation of the shoot post. So this will be, um, we've just fin we will finish shooting the other day, so I'm just going to do a quick evaluation of it and see how. Just let you know how everything went and tell you about all the positives and all the negatives and all that jazz in between. So um, first off, I guess I'll sort of talk about my experience acting and um, how that sort of went for me. Um, it wasn't half as bad as I'd expected it to be, considering I knew everyone and everything like that, and I wasn't at any point complaining to be an uh, um, proclaiming, not complaining, proclaiming. I was complaining a lot, uh, proclaiming to be an actor. I didn't feel all that sort of much in the way of pressure, and at the end of the day, the buck stops with me as well, because it's my project anyway. So if I've if I've fluffed up acting, then I'm the only one to blame for that, and I can't sort of um, yeah be arsy with anyone else about it. And besides, it's my project and it's my party, and I'll cry if I want to. So um, that's sort of it. But um, yeah, no, acting was acting was actually all right. It was quite good fun. I think my experience of directing actors was significantly different because I was focusing on my performance as well. I could kind of relate things back and stuff like that. I felt it felt more relatable. It wasn't just saying say it angrier. Like maybe maybe do it if that was a ten, give me a twelve. That that kind of all that stupid stuff. But um, yeah, so it was nice. It was nice to see things from another perspective and sort of directing myself was weird, but um, kind of it allowed me to sit down with the other guys and kind of, because most of the shots were just in the lounge, so we were all sat down anyway. It was a nice relaxed shoot and everyone was, and it was just kind of, maybe you can just do that slightly different and no one was too bothered or too tired with the takes and stuff like that, so we didn't have the usual kind of like Aggie shoot and that kind of thing. So um, yeah, I think in terms of acting... I guess it was uh, a positive experience. Um, we didn't uh, get started as soon as as soon as I'd have liked in the morning. There were a few things that I had to sort. I had to drop off footage for another project that I was filming on, and kind of all stuff like that, and get the lighting set up, and get my actors together, and that kind of thing. Biggest problem being me. I needed my coffee in the morning, but um, yeah, generally speaking, everyone was very positive. Um, we started about two hours late, so um, that led to a bit of a problem later on, but um, I'm hoping it's not going to be too much to the detriment of the piece. Um, but yeah, we stopped about five o'clock, and um, can't shoot on... We, we didn't shoot on Sunday, or well, at least not with the full crew. It was just me and Alex shooting um, some of the... Basically, Sunday we shot... Alex and I shot scene one, basically, because seeing as it was only him on screen and then me carrying the GoPro camera for the um, Tony point of view shots um, it was quite easy so I just got a chance to set up the lighting have a nice croissant and um, just get Alex all set up and ready and stuff so we had to we had to I was quite ingenious with a piece of cardboard blocking the light from the outside which was nice um, and uh, yeah the shots look nice enough they're not kind of obviously as I mentioned in a previous post I'm in no way a cameraman so I just tried to emulate the lighting setup that um, Alex and I put together as closely as possible and hope that the camera settings are going to be okay. So um, we'll find out when I have a look at it on the big screen how grainy it is and stuff like that. But um, I've got a feeling it's going to be the weaker of the weaker of all the footage because it's um, yeah a little more complex and we were running it with a much smaller team. But at the end of the day, it had the it only had one actor in it who I knew was going to be available on the Sunday, so I just had to wait until the Sunday to do that. Um, we weren't able to uh, shoot scene four, unfortunately, which is the one where they talk about um, sort of, oh yeah, those tits, that kind of thing. The one with the fun bags lying in it and stuff like that. So the bit where they um, actually decide that Tony's possessed, which is kind of a shame that I'm losing that. But at the same time, the more and more I've thought about it, I think for the proof of concept, the way I'm working with it, it's going to be, I think it's going to be preferable to end the whole piece on um, the well that's peculiar line because I think that's going to have quite a lot of oomph to it and kind of a um, yeah a bit of a push bit of a bit of a bang basically it ends on something interesting it's kind of a little funny line and it will hopefully leave people wanting more which is what I want to ach wanted to achieve from the project which is what I want to achieve from the proof of concept anyway ready for a full project next year fingers crossed but um, yeah, primarily, uh, I guess it all went well. Uh, I've had a look at some of the rushes and stuff like that. I'll probably do a um, 
either a screen capture post like directly talking about the rushes or I'll look at um, look at them as I'm going through the edit or so, stuff like that because this will probably be um, in fact this will be the last of my uh, video blog posts before I move over to screen capturing on my PC which I'm going to be um, obviously doing all my editing on and stuff like that so you'll see as I'm as I'm going along how things are how things are developing without my big ugly face on screen which would be nice so um, yeah expect those very soon and um, yeah so to I suppose I should summarize actually seeing as I've been a bit incoherent on this post um, yeah to summarize basically shoot all in all went well um, didn't have a terrible time acting like I'm sure I'll find out whether or not I hate it in the in the rushes and stuff like that but currently fairly proud of my acting if I do say so myself um, what's the other one? Oh, um, didn't manage to film scene 4 which was um, a shame but once again it's something that I can, I can overcome fairly simply it was the biggest scene that we'd have had to film and it would have been and while it would have been nice to have it the piece isn't going to suffer at the end of the day for the lack of it. If anything, it's going to end on a better dramatic point and that kind of thing. And scene one, the stuff with the croissant. Um, oh, look like I'm backhanding, but um, there, yeah, four. Uh, scene one went okay. Kind of, um, as I said, filmed it on the Sunday with the skeleton crew of me and me, pretty much me as the crew and Alex acting. But um, I don't think the I don't think it's going to be too terrible. The footage might be a little bit grainy or something like that. But um, proof of concept, and it's the best I could do with what I had, the um, resources I had. So um, all in all, fairly positive, and expect to see some beautiful 1080p screen capture videos fairly soon. Goodbye.